What's up everyone, this is Cybernet8610, and today we have our uh, Brother of the Fire Fist Tiger King Mega Ten opening. We opened up the Bojinte one, which had uh, Susano. Well, now we have, of course, the uh, Fire Fist one. So, looks pretty cool. As you can tell, the tin is a lot bigger. I mean, you can just kind of tell that, hopefully, from the, even the video. I like how the tins are bigger. It's kind of... Kind of cool. You can store more cards in them, I guess, for people that use them for uh, storing your cards. I use like a big plastic container for mine, people that are wondering. I don't really use tins on that. Right, there we go. Threats aside. How to pendulum summon. You don't know how? Well, this will come in handy, of course. You get this, and of course a little advertisement showing all the different stuff you can get. Let's see. Here's the promos. You'll get the same promos in each tin, but everything else uh, should be different. You know, everything else is random. I'll show you guys the promos. If I can get it out of this plastic. There we go. Alright, we have, of course, Tiger King, which looks really nice, too. And, and, the, and the new Secret Rare, like Platinum Secret Rare. Uh, yeah, again, I was kind of worried these wouldn't look as good. Although, man, they almost look fake in a way. Because it's just so much like glitter-like looking to them. Uh, anyway, we also have Brother... Brotherhood of the Firefist Gorilla, and we have a number 47 Nightmare Shark. I like that reprint. That was one I was uh, happy to see a reprint for. So now for the Mega Packs. You're getting three Mega Packs on this. So, uh, of course, each one is going to have a Super, an Ultra, and a Secret Rare card. Oh, yeah, and a regular Rare, of course. So you're guaranteed to get Hollows from these. Also, for people that are wondering, I forgot to mention this in the last video, they're still $20. The tins are the same price as the older tins. They're just bigger now and different packs. Right, let's see, we have a bunch of different comments. We have Archfiend Giant. We have Gauntlet Launcher. Oh, that's a pretty good Ultra Rare, I guess. A Shared Ride for our Secret Rare. And a Bajini Hair. There you go. Not too bad on that one. I like Shared Ride. I feel bad for Sangin. Right, second pack. These make for quicker pack openings, too. Let's see, Googly Eyes Drum Dragon. You gotta love that card. See, we have Wheel of Prophecy, then a Sylvan uh, Marshall Leaf for our Ultra Rare Pinpoint Guard Secret Rare. That's a good reprint, actually, too, on that, so not bad. And uh, Sacred Sword of the Seven Stars, or of Seven Stars. I always put the V in it, I guess, for some reason. I don't know why. I don't want to read, I guess. All kinds of other commons and stuff. There's some pretty good common reprints. I mean, more than likely, you're not going to need any of the reprints of the commons, but uh, there's a few good ones on there. I guess if you didn't get any of the previous packs, though, this is a good way to get some of the good comments from previous sets. I like Shark Fortress. That's a good one. There we go. Do a barrel roll for our rare. Then we have number 101, Silent Honor Art. Freaking awesome. This is a really good reprint for this set. I'm, I'm glad they did this, too. I, I was a little bit worried when they announced the promos. I'm glad this is actually in a pack. And, uh, yeah, I, I, hopefully it's not too short printed for people. I, on that, So hopefully it's not too short printed because I was worried about that, too. Uh, let's see. Uh, Rainbow Karibo. And uh, we have uh, the Evil Swarm. Uh, Evil Swarm Kirikion, I think. I, I've never said this card right. So, yeah. I know people hate it when I don't try to at least pronounce it. So... Hopefully I at least said that right. For a second I thought I got two of the same comment on that. Oh well. Losing my mind. Anyway, uh, number 101 I guess really threw me off. But yeah, I'm glad to see that I got this card at least. Still needing Drago Sack though. So hopefully I'll get that because like I said I'm going to do a case opening. And uh, I've, like I've said in the previous video, I've seen some uh, people get some really good stuff from these. And uh, some not so good. So I don't know how good the ratios are for some of the better reprints. Of course, like number 101, Excite All Night, and Drago Sack. Because those seem like, of course, the main three that people are wanting. But hopefully, uh, they're pretty good ratios on that. Because I was at least able to get 101, and that's out of 210. So maybe other people have that kind of luck. Hopefully, it's not just luck. And that other people that need those cards uh, can get them easily. But yeah, of course, uh, thank you for watching. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And like I said, we'll have a case opening uh, sometime next week, hopefully. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys later. See ya.